Hanukkah. The Jewish people are miraculously saved from annihilation from our enemies. Yet when you ask people, so what's the miracle of Hanukkah? What does everybody say? That the oil burned for eight days and eight nights. Now that was a miracle. But I want you to think about this for a second. If the miracle of the oil didn't happen, where would we be today? Arguably, we'd be sitting right here where you are right now. If the miracle of the victory over the Greeks didn't happen, where would we be today? Arguably, not here. We may have been annihilated. So how can we say that the big miracle of Hanukkah is that the oil burned for eight days? Come on, you can't compare. You know, I remember years ago, I had this employer. And he did all the things employers do. He paid my salary, gave me my benefits. But there was one thing he did that made such an impression on me. I remember he was always saying thank you. He always made sure to say thank you. He always gave me a pat on the back, positive reinforcement. He always had a kind word, something nice to say. And it made an impression because I thought to myself, you know, he doesn't have to do this. By contract, he needs to give me my benefits, pay my salary, and that's it. But he always made sure to say thank you. He always made sure to go the extra mile. And it made such an impression on me. And I really created a connection between him and me. And I think this is the message of Hanukkah. One could argue, and I'm not saying this is true, but one could argue that the Almighty had to save us. He promises us in the Torah, he's never going to let us be annihilated. We're going to be his eternal nation. So you could argue, I'm not saying for sure, but you could argue he had to save us. But when it comes to the miracle of oil, one thing's for sure. He did not have to do that miracle. He did not have to. You cannot argue that he had to do that. He did not. That was the Almighty saying, here's one extra. I don't want to just pay your salary and your benefits. I want to go above and beyond. I want to give you the pat on the back, the hug, the kiss. I want to give you one extra. That's the Almighty. This is the message of Hanukkah. To realize that HaKadosh Baruch the Almighty does so much more than He has to for us. It's a message that I think we can take out and apply to our own lives for those around us. To look at those who work for us, to look at our family and friends, to look at everybody around us. Whether it's in a work setting or whether it's out of a work setting. And to appreciate people and to go above and beyond the extra thank you, even though they had to. To be like the Almighty. To go the extra mile for all the people around us with the kind word, the hello, the thank you, the kiss, the hug. But to also realize that this is what the Almighty does for us in all of our lives. He goes the extra mile. To look at our lives, our health, our family, the blessings and gifts we have, and to ask ourselves, does he really need to do this? Or is this just my creator going the extra mile? I want to wish you all a very happy Hanukkah.